English for Arabs is English for all. Presentation Plus is available exclusively with the new fourth edition of Interchange, the most widely used and the most successful English course in the world, incorporating video, audio, and even online resources, all with the click of a mouse. Highlight key concepts. Reveal answers to exercises. Annotate passages. Play class audio passages and video segments. And even embed web links right into your lessons. You can learn English as a second language. Unit 11. 11. Interchange 1. Unit 11. It's a very exciting place. In Unit 11, Exercise 1. Word power. Adjectives. Here, look at the picture. This is what beautiful flowers, wonderful place. This is beautiful. Beautiful, nice. Very good. This picture. Ugly. Pollution. Ugly. Beautiful. Ugly. A. Pair work. Match each word in column A with its opposite in column B. Then add two more pairs of adjectives to the list. Column here in silent. So in this exercise, you will match 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 until 10 with A, B, C, D. Okay? Then you write here an adjective and another opposite. One minute, try to finish. Finished. Number one, beautiful, beautiful, opposite, opposite, beautiful, opposite, ugly, H, one, H, H, ugly. Number two, cheap, cheap, expensive, expensive, D, two, D, three, clean, 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 F. Polluted, polluted. Four. Interesting, interesting. E silent. Interesting. A boring. Five. Quiet, quiet. E noisy. Six. Relaxing, relaxing. Opposite. G. Stressful. Stressful under stress. 7. Safe. Safe. Opposite. Dangerous. Dangerous. C. 8. Spacious. Spacious. Spacious space. You have a lot of space. Spacious. Spacious. Large. Opposite. B. Crowded. 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 Too small. You have a lot of things. Again, the answers. 1. H. 2. D. 3. F. 4. A. 5. E. 6. G. 7. C. A, B. In number nine, you can have more adjectives. Small, big. Tall, short. Good, bad. Generous, generous likes to give a person who likes to give generous opposite miser generous miser 
Miser doesn't like to spend money. Generous, miser. Local, international. Local, international, or international, international, universal. B. Per work. Choose two places you know. Describe them to your partner using the words in part A. So here, you will have two words and you try to make sentences. Make a sentence. Write a sentence. Say a sentence. Put the word in a sentence. Example. Life in Cairo is stressful. Life in Cairo is stressful and polluted. Life in Cairo is stressful and polluted. Life in the village. Life in the countryside. Life is clean is clean and relaxing. Life in the countryside, relaxing and clean. Life in Cairo is stressful and polluted. Conversation It's a fairly big city. Look at the picture here. What do you see? San Juan. San Juan. Sunny. The weather is sunny. See so a cloud. Beach. Palm tree. A palm tree. Palm trees. Four, five, six, seven. Palm trees. Beach house, beach house, house on the beach. Buildings, skyscraper, 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 a very high building. A skyscraper is very high building. Clouds. San Juan. This is San Juan. It's a wonderful place. San Juan is a wonderful city. Let's start to listen to the conversation. Listen and practice. So where are you from, Carmen? I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow. I've heard that's a really nice city. Yeah, it is. The weather is great and there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Is it expensive there? No, it's not very expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. It sounds perfect to me. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. Eric and Carmen are talking. Eric, so where are you from, Carmen? I am from San Juan, San Juan, Puerto Rico. Wow, I've, I've, I've heard it's a really nice city. City, T soft D. Yeah, yeah, means yep, yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah, it is, it is, T soft D. The weather is great, and there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Beaches just outside the city. The city T soft D. Is it expensive there? Is San Juan expensive? No, it's not very expensive. Very expensive. Yeah, sound between Y and E. It's not very expensive. Prices are pretty reasonable. Pretty, very. 
T soft D. Pretty, pretty reasonable. They are very reasonable. They are okay. Not expensive and not cheap. How big is the city? How big is the city? T soft D. It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. The city is fairly big, fairly big, rather big, somewhat big. It sounds perfect to me. It sounds. It sounds. It seems. It's perfect. Perfect. Excellent. It's perfect to me. It seems perfect to me. Maybe I should plan a trip there sometime. To go on a trip, to go on vacation, vacation. Now, let's answer some questions. Where is Carmen from? She's from San Juan, Puerto Rico. What's San Juan, Puerto Rico like? It's a really nice city. It's a really nice city. The weather is great, and there are some fantastic beaches just outside the city. Is San Juan expensive? No, it's not very expensive. Why? Because, because, short, cause. Because, cause. Because prices are pretty reasonable. How big is the city? It's a fairly big city, but it's not too big. Is it perfect to live in San Juan? Yes,、yeah. it sounds perfect. B, listen to the rest of the conversation. What does Carmen say about entertainment in San Juan? What does Carmen say about entertainment in San Juan? Listen. Page seventy-two, exercise two, part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What does Carmen say about entertainment in San Juan? So, what kinds of things are there to do in San Juan? Well, there are a lot of nightclubs. Puerto Ricans love to dance. I'm not much of a dancer. Anything else? Well, a lot of people enjoy going out to eat. There are some excellent restaurants in Old San Juan. They're popular with both locals and tourists. Now that sounds good. I love to eat. Listen again. So, what kinds of things are there to do in San Juan? Well, there are a lot of nightclubs. Puerto Ricans love to dance. I'm not much of a dancer. Anything else? Well, a lot of people enjoy going out to eat. There are some excellent restaurants in Old San Juan. They're popular with both locals and tourists. Now that sounds good. I love to eat. B. What does Carmen say about entertainment in San Juan? If you are a tourist, and you and you visit San Juan, what will you do? Where will you go? In San Juan. There are a lot of nightclubs because Puerto Ricans like to dance. They love to dance. They like to go dancing. Also, there are a lot of excellent restaurants and bars. They have wonderful food for both locals and tourists. They make great food in restaurants. You will find great food for both locals and tourists, for foreigners and the people of San Juan. Exercise number three. 
Grammar focus. Adverbs before adjectives. Page 73. Exercise 3. Grammar focus. Adverbs before adjectives. San Juan is really nice. It's a really nice city. It's fairly big. It's a fairly big city. It's not very expensive. It's not a very expensive place. It's too noisy and it's too crowded for me. Adverbs before adjectives. You know adjectives describe people, sayings like nice, expensive, gentle, kind, big adjectives. Adverbs, you know adverb was L-Y like Ahmed is walking quickly or Ahmed walks quickly the adverb ends with L-Y and describes the verb no we are not talking about this kind of adverbs today we'll talk about adverbs before adjective like extremely very really pretty fairly somewhat Let's read. San Juan is really nice. Really nice. So if I ask you, what's San Juan like? It, it's nice. San Juan is nice. So is it just nice, somewhat nice, really nice? San Juan is really nice. So really here, adverb and describe nice, adjective. Nice, adjective, really Adverb. It's a fairly big, fairly big, fairly adverb, big adjective. It's not very expensive, very expensive. It's too noisy and it's too crowded for me. Too noisy, too crowded. So two adverb, noisy, crowded adjective. San Juan is really nice. It's a really nice city. It's fairly big. It's a fairly big city. It's not very expensive. It's not a very expensive place. So here you can put a or an plus adverb really, fairly plus adjective nice, big, expensive plus noun and the noun city place let's check this powerpoint presentation first no after two here too crowded too too noisy too bad two plus bad adjective adverbs before adjectives adverbs before adjectives Adverbs that describe adjectives. What's an adjective? An adjective like fast, slow, big, small, dirty, dirty, not clean, opposite, clean, dirty, opposite, clean, dangerous. Opposite, safe. Noisy. Opposite, quiet. Adjective, opposite. American, opposite. O-A. Fast, slow. Big, small. Dirty, clean. Dangerous, safe. Noisy, quiet. These are adjectives and these are opposites. New, modern, opposite, old, unfriendly, friendly, friendly, opposite, unfriendly, not friendly, not sociable, exciting, exciting, T sub D, exciting, interesting, 
Opposite, boring. Expensive, expensive, cheap. Expensive, cheap. Adjectives. We use adjectives to describe people, animals, things. We use adjectives to describe. Ahmed is short. Ali is tall. Elephants are big. BMW is expensive. So here, adjectives short, tall, big, expensive. I describe people, Ahmed, Ali, animals, elephants, lions, tigers, things, BMW, car. Ahmed is a short boy, so adjective short, boy, boy now. Ali is a tall boy. Elephants are big animals. BMW is an expensive car. An expensive p sound p p an expensive car. So in these examples, a a tall boy a adjective singular noun one a boy a boy a tall boy. Big big animals. An expensive car an expensive car. A adjective plus one car here i can write adjective or a and adjective plus singular noun singular noun one a boy one boy a car one car animals two three four five here we don't put a or an we don't put a or an because elephants are plural a plural noun adverbs before adjectives what's Ahmed like Ahmed is nice what's Ahmed like Ahmed is nice is he very nice is he really nice or somewhat nice? Hmm. Here, you want to describe nice. You want to describe nice, the adjective nice. Very nice, Ahmed is very, very nice. Really nice or somewhat nice, just nice. Sometimes nice, sometimes is not nice. What describes the adjective? Nice. The adverb. Adverb? Extremely. Very. Really. Pretty. Pretty? T soft D. Fairly. Fairly? Rather. Somewhat. Somewhat? 50%. Sometimes nice. Sometimes he's not nice. 50-50. Ahmed is Ahmed is extremely nice 100% nice 100% Ahmed is very nice 90% Ahmed is very nice 90% Ahmed is really nice 80 really 80 Ahmed is pretty nice 70% Ahmed is fairly nice, fairly rather, 60%. Ahmed is somewhat nice, sometimes nice, sometimes he's not, he's not nice, 50%. The adverbs, extremely, very, really, pretty, fairly, somewhat. These are adverbs that describe adjectives adverbs before adjectives what's Ahmed like 
He is a very nice man. So here you can have subject, M is R, adverb, adjective. The adverb describes the adjective. The adjective, the adjective describes the noun. Adverb describes adjective. Adjective describes the noun. Ahmed is an extremely nice man. Ahmed is a man. Ahmed is a nice man. Ahmed is an extremely nice man. Ahmed is a, a very nice man. Here, a. An extremely, because extremely, e, vowel. An extremely nice man. Vowels, a, e, i, o, u. Ahmed is a very nice man. Ahmed is a really nice man. Ahmed is a pretty nice man. Ahmed is a fairly nice man. Ahmed is somewhat nice man. So here you put a or an. Because the noun, singular. Singular noun, one, man. Plural, two, three, four, men. Ahmed and Tamer. Ahmed and Tamer are very nice men. Ahmed and Tamer are very nice men. In this example, I don't put a or an because, because men is a plural noun. Two, three, four, five men. So you say, Ahmed and Tamer are very nice men. Match the questions with the answers. Then practice the conversations. One. What's so like? Is it an interesting place? C. Yes. It has amazing shopping and the people are pretty friendly. Pretty friendly. Very friendly. Number two. Do you like your hometown? Why or why not? Two. D. Not really. It's too small. And it's really boring. That's why I moved away. Not really. It's too small. And it's really boring. That's why I moved away. So number two. D. Three. Three. What's Sydney like? I've never been there. Sydney. Describe Sydney. Sydney in Australia. Three. A. Oh, really? It's beautiful and very clean. It's beautiful and very clean. It has a great harbor and beautiful beaches harbor port harbor port like port side four have you ever been to sao paulo have you ever been to sao paulo b yes i have it's an extremely large and crowded place but I, T soft D, but I, but I love it. It has excellent restaurants. The answers again, number one, C, number two, D, three, A, four, B, one, C, two, D, three, A, four, B. Four A conjunctions lesson focus listen again focus conjunctions it's an exciting city and the weather is nice it's a big city but it's not too big it's a big city it's not too big though 
It's a big city. It's not too big, however. Conjunctions. Conjunctions and but, though, or though, however. an exciting city, exciting, interesting, and the weather is nice. It's a big city, city T sub D, but it's not too big. It's a big city. It's not too big though, though, like although, however, but it's a big city. It's not too big, however. So we use but, though, however, although, contrast, contrast opposite. Big, not too big, opposite. Big city, not too big city, opposite. Big city is not too big city. Ob and, but, though, and however. Let's check this wonderful PowerPoint presentation. Conjunctions. Conjunctions. And, but, Though, however, although, conjunctions, and, but, though, however, although, and. Example, it's an exciting city, the weather is nice. It's an exciting city, and the weather is nice. It's, it is, it is an exciting city, and the weather is nice. And, we use and to join two sentences together. It's an exciting city, a sentence. The weather is nice, second sentence. It's an exciting city, and the weather is nice. Exciting, nice. The two senses are good. No contrast. There is no contrast between the two sentences. The city is interesting. The weather is nice. It's an exciting city and the weather is nice. A sentence and second sentence. And is used to join two sentences together. And Ali is nice. Ali is kind. Ali is gentle. Ali is nice, kind. And gentle. Adjective, adjective, and adjective. First thing, adjective, comma. Second adjective, adjective number two, comma. And adjective number three, the last one. And the last adjective. And. Al is nice, Al is kind, Al is gentle. Al is nice, kind, and gentle. Adjective, comma, adjective, comma, and number three, the last adjective. He likes to sing, he likes to dance. He likes to play the piano. He likes to play the piano. 
sing and dance play sing and dance verb verb and the last verb so he likes to play the piano he likes to sing he likes to dance he likes to play the piano sing and dance and what are your dreams my dreams are to have health money and family to have health to be healthy to have money to be rich and family a noun a noun and the last noun and what are your dreams what a t sub d what are my dreams are to have health money and family a noun a noun and a noun but ahmed is rich he's unhappy unhappy not happy sad ahmed is rich but he's unhappy we use but for contrast contrast opposite rich if you are rich you will be happy but here he's rich he's unhappy he's very sad opposite contrast opposite ahmed is rich but he's unhappy so we use but to express contrast contrast american contrast but ozo l silent ozo equals but ozo equals but a ahmed is rich he's unhappy although ahmed is rich he's unhappy although ahmed is rich he's unhappy again although ahmed is rich he's unhappy ahmed is unhappy although he's rich although in the beginning of two sentences although in the middle between two sentences i can use although in the beginning or in the middle although equals but ahmed is rich he's unhappy Although Ahmed is rich, he's unhappy. Ahmed is unhappy, although he's rich. Ahmed is unhappy, although he's rich. So, so equals although equals but in the meaning. We use all of them for contrast. The food is delicious. The food has a good taste. It's not too expensive. The good the food delicious. It should be too expensive, but here contrast opposite. Delicious, not expensive. The food is delicious. It's not too expensive though. So I can put though at the end, comma though. Though more informal than also a sentence full stop a sentence comma though a sentence full stop a sentence comma though though
However, though, although, but we use them for contrast, opposite. Ahmed is rich. However, he's unhappy. However, between two sentences. Ahmed is rich, full stop. However, comma, second sentence. Sentence number one. However, comma, sentence number two. The weather is nice. Summer is very hot. However, so the weather is nice. Nice, but, but it's very hot. So opposite nice and very hot. So the weather is nice. Summer is very hot, comma, however. A sentence, full stop. A sentence, comma, however. B. Choose the correct conjunctions and rewrite the sentences. In this question, you choose and, but, and, though, and, however. It's number one. Number two. You write the sentence again. Taipei is very nice. Everyone is extremely friendly. Okay. Taipei is very nice and everyone is extremely friendly. And. And. British. American. And. Number two. The streets are crowded. It's easy to get around. So. The streets are crowded. We have a lot of cars in the streets. But it's easy to get around. So we have here contrast. The answer use and or though. Though. The streets are crowded. It's easy to get around. Comma. Though. Comma. Though. The streets are crowded. It's easy to get around, comma, though. 3. The weather is nice. Summers get pretty hot. Pretty, very, pretty hot, very hot. Nice and very hot. This is contrast, opposite. 3. The weather is nice. Summers get pretty hot, comma, however. Comma, however. Four. Four. Shopping is great. Shopping, British, American, shopping. You have to bargain in the markets. Bargain to negotiate about the price. So, four. Shopping is great, but, but you have to bargain in the markets. Shopping is great, but you have to bargain in the markets. This shirt or this t-shirt, 100 pounds. Say, no, 50. Say, 70 at the end. 5. The food is delicious. It's not too expensive. The food is delicious. It's not too expensive, comma, though. The food is delicious. When the food is delicious, it should be expensive, but here, not expensive. So the food is delicious, it's not too expensive though, comma, though. Six. It's an amazing city. It's an amazing city. I love to give, I love to go there. It's an amazing city and, and I love to go there. It's an amazing city and I love to go there. Number C. Describe three cities or towns in your country. The two positive and one negative feature for each. So here, you describe a city in this exercise and you say good, positive, good, good adjectives and one bad adjective. One positive or, and one negative or two positive and one negative. Two good and one bad. Example, 
Lima. Lima is very exciting and there are a lot of things to do, but it's too cold. Exciting, interesting. A lot of things to do, but it's too cold. This is bad adjective. This is negative. Positive, a lot of things and exciting. The weather in Shanghai is and you make a sentence. In Egypt, Sharm el Sheikh is a very exciting city. It's a wonderful place. There are a lot of beaches. Prices are pretty reasonable. Prices are very reasonable. But it's far away from my home. It's far from my home. It's far from Cairo. Exercise 4. Listening. My hometown. Listen to Joyce and Nicholas talk about their hometowns. What do they say? Check the correct boxes. 1. So tell me about your hometown, Joyce. Well, it's a really small town. What's it like there? Oh, I think it's boring. Really? Why? Well, there's nothing to do. No good restaurants, no nightlife. Oh, that's too bad. But small towns are pretty inexpensive to live in. Well, yeah, it is really cheap. And lots of people love it there because it's very pretty. Yeah? Uh-huh. It has great scenery. Lots of mountains and rivers, lakes and trees. Well, I don't know, Joyce. It sounds like a great place. Listen again. So tell me about your hometown, Joyce. Well, it's a really small town. What's it like there? Oh, I think it's boring. Really? Why? Well, there's nothing to do. No good restaurants, no nightlife. Oh, that's too bad. But small towns are pretty inexpensive to live in. Well, yeah, it is really cheap. And lots of people love it there because it's very pretty. Yeah? Uh-huh. It has great scenery. Lots of mountains and rivers, lakes and trees. Well, I don't know, Joyce. It sounds like a great place. Number one, Joyce. What's her hometown like? Big or small? Her hometown is small. Small, so big, no, small. Is it interesting? No, no, it's not interesting. It's boring. Why is it boring? Because there isn't nightlife. There are no restaurants. Is it expensive? Is it expensive? No, it's inexpensive. Inexpensive. Inexpensive, not expensive. Cheap. Is it beautiful? Yes. It's very beautiful. Why? It has wonderful place. It's a wonderful place. It has a lot of rivers, mountains, lakes, trees, parks. So it's very pretty. Nicholas, let's listen to Nicholas. Two. Do you come from a big city, Nicholas? Yeah, I guess. It's pretty big. So there's a lot to do there? Yeah, it's a really fun place. 
It has some cool art museums and great theaters and restaurants. Really? How are the prices? Is it expensive? I guess so. Food costs a lot in the supermarket and in restaurants. And apartments, the rents are very high. And what's it like there? What does it look like? Well, it's very clean, and it's really pretty, too. There are lots of parks and trees right in the center of the city. Listen again. Two. Do you come from a big city, Nicholas? Yeah, I guess. It's pretty big. So there's a lot to do there? Yeah, it's a really fun place. It has some cool art museums and great theaters and restaurants. Really? How are the prices? Is it expensive? I guess so. Food costs a lot in the supermarket and in restaurants. And apartments, the rents are very high. And what's it like there? What does it look like? Well, it's very clean, and it's really pretty, too. There are lots of parks and trees right in the center of the city. Number two, Nicholas. What about Nicholas' hometown? Is it big? Yes, it's pretty big. Pretty big, very big. Is it interesting? Yes, it's very interesting. Why? Because there are great museums and there are cool art museums. and wonderful restaurants. Is it expensive? Yes, it's expensive because food costs a lot and the rents are very high. Food costs a lot, food costs a lot of money and the rents are very high. When you rent a flat, when you hire a flat, it will cost you a lot of money. Is it beautiful? Yes, it is. It's very clean and it's very pretty. Pretty beautiful. There are lots of parks and trees in the city center. Writing an interesting place. Write about an interesting town or city for tourists to visit in your country. Now look at the picture, what do you see? A wonderful place. This is a mountain and this is the environment. Scenery. This is a scenery. The natural environment. Different houses. Maybe a college. So let's read. Otavalo. Otavalo is a very interesting town in Ecuador. It's to the north of Quito. It has a fantastic market, a wonderful market, and a lot of tourists go there to buy local handicrafts. Handicrafts, handmade products. The scenery around Otavalo is very pretty. The scenery, the countryside, the appearance of the natural environment is very beautiful. Pretty beautiful. So, this is an interesting town or city for tourists to visit. So, can you write about a very famous place, an interesting town or city in your country? This is going to be homework. Exercise 6. Snapshot. Vacation spots. Vacation holiday. 6 popular cities, 6 famous cities and some sites and events there. 6 famous cities and some sightseeings and events there. One, look at the picture. This is Disney Wallet. 
Where is the Disney World? Orlando, Florida. What is the meaning of Disney World? Look at the picture, you see here? Different cartoon characters. A lot of kids, a lot of children. A Disney World, a famous theme park. A famous theme park. Picture number two, you see here, different bicycles, bikes, a lot of bikers, a lot of bikers, the Tour de France, Paris, France, the Tour de France. Three, look at the picture here. What do you see? The Golden Market. The Golden Market. Dubai, United Arab Emirates. You see here a lot of jewels. The Golden Market is a famous jewelry market. Picture four, Carnival, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Carnival. A famous street party for samba music, dancing, eating, and drinking. The Forbidden City. A lot of tourists, a lot of people, and this is, is the Forbidden City. This is like a famous palace. The Forbidden City is a famous palace in China. Java Jazz Festival. You see different persons. They are singing and playing music. This is the Java Jazz Festival in Jakarta, Indonesia. Java Jazz Festival is an annual festival for jazz music. Annual every year. It's a festival it's a festival for jazz music every year. Which places would you like to visit and why? Which places would you like to visit and why? Put the places you'd like to visit in order from the most interesting to least interesting. I like to visit Disney World, the Forbidden City, and the Golden Market. What three other places in the world would you like to visit and why? I like to visit the Pyramids, the Sphinx, Cairo Tower, Hurghada, Sharm el Sheikh, Dubai, and Mecca. Unit 11. It's a very exciting place. Exciting. Exciting. T Saf D. Interesting. Unit 11. It's a very exciting place. One, the words in exercise number one. Beautiful, ugly, beautiful, T soft D. Beautiful, ugly, cheap, expensive, clean, polluted, clean, polluted, interesting, interesting, E silent, interesting, boring. Don't say interesting, wrong, interesting, E silent, interesting. Quiet, noisy, relaxing, stressful, spacious, crowded, famous, unknown. Famous means known, opposite unknown, unknown, not known. Pretty, pretty, T soft D, pretty, ugly. Number two. 
plan, plan a trap. Pretty reasonable, pretty reasonable. T sub D, pretty reasonable. Fairly, rather. Three. Adverbs, adverbs. Extremely, very, really, really, fairly, rather, somewhat, somewhat, rather, conjunctions, conjunctions, and, but, zo, ozo, ozo, el side, ozo, however, pretty hot, pretty, t sub d, pretty hot. Very hot. Bargain. Bargain. Verb. Bargain. A bargain. Features. Characteristics. Features. Cara. Character. Characteristics. Characteristic. Characteristics. Characteristics. Features. Characteristics. State. To mention. To mention. A state. A country. Four exercise four. Hometown. Nightlife. Entertainment in nightclubs. A rent. A hire. Hire verb. Hire. The rents. Scenery. Scene. View. Scenery, scene, view. Cool, wonderful, fantastic. Cool, wonderful, fantastic. Exercise five, five. Amazing, fantastic, unimaginable. Amazing, fantastic, unimaginable. Airline, airline, article, is say, plenty, much, sound, see, plenty, much, sound, see, carnival, carnival, Public enjoyment and entertainment. Walk of fame. Walk, American, British, walk. Walk of fame. Of, walk of, of, F as V. Walk of fame. A famous area where the names of many celebrities are on the sidewalk. Celebrities, T sub D. Tour de France. A famous bicycle race. Tour de France. A famous bicycle race. In order, in a range. Sites. 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 Sightseeing. Most. Least. Share videos. It's a community. We're all doing this together.